Ableton Basics video one. So just going to look at the, the basic overview of Ableton so you get a feel for this and being able to start make some simple uh, soundtracks for your games. So uh, Ableton is a very straightforward piece of software to pick up and have a play with. Um, you've got two different view modes and you get to these with tab or these little buttons here. So hitting tab will go between these views. This view is called uh, session view where we can do our mixing, we can move our, our faders and drop in clips. And this is where we, uh, it's called arrangement view so we can layer in things here and create uh, full arrangements of tracks. It's also where we can uh, set our locators and start to export things too. So um, straight off the bat, moving around Ableton, tab will get you between these two different views, um, or these two little things up here. To uh, zoom in and out, you move your mouse up to the top here on the time that the ruler, the, the, the bars across the top, uh, click and hold the left mouse button, dragging up and down will zoom in, and dragging left and right will move along the timeline. If I put some music in here, so we've got a sample, um, you can drag up and down to zoom in and out, and drag along to um, get about your scene. So um, let's go into some basic editing. So I'm in arrangement view. If I've dragged in a few things here, you can see that if I hit play, I've just got a, a pad sound. I can drag the start and cut out bits that I don't want. And I can drag the end and you can cut things like that. So very straightforward. Uh, another nice thing that you can do is you can loop things. So if I were to keep uh, dragging this out, can you see that it's looping it? So very straightforward way to loop stuff. Also, um, you can drag and drag things around. You can select things. Control C to copy. Control V to paste. So it's very quick and easy to start messing about with this audio, cutting it up, changing it. Um, if you want to delete bits, select the bits you don't want, and hit backspace, and it'll delete it. So very quickly, you can start to mess about and create some simple loops going. So that's the sort of basic view of getting around and editing things, chopping things, selecting things, moving and pasting. It's all very simple and easy to do. Um, let's say we want some sounds to play with. So you can go to clips and there'll be a whole bunch of clips in here that you can drag in. And also, uh, there's a nice link that I've shared called, um, if you just come out of this, Music Radar, free, sound, free music samples, download loops, hits, and multis from Sample Radar. So this is a whole list of, um, you'll see loads of different samples, packs that you can download, and these are, most of these are loops. So if you have a look through here, we've got hip hop, jazz, crowd rock, lo-fi, synths, ambient stuff, percussion, drums. There's, there's a whole bunch of stuff in here. So think about your games, think about the style of soundtrack that you want, and download a couple of these packs. So let's say you've got a few things. Let's you know, I'll download this one, for example. You just click on it and go, all right, okay, um, let's listen to a few things. Okay, and then you just download them. So you can see here, I've downloaded a few. I've got a chill out thing, I'm downloading this. To get those into Ableton, it's very simple. You can um, find them in Explorer. So this is my downloads. Let me just uh, extract these. So you see how this is a zip folder. Just extract that and then, oops, one sec. Uh, that one. Hit extract, extract all. And then that will allow us to open up the folder and see what's inside. Um, I've already done that with a couple of other folders here. So I've got some ambient samples, I've got some analog drum and bass samples which I've just downloaded. And then I've got some 
uh, chill out samples. So let's just extract those two. So very important that you extract that because you can't open zip folders in Ableton. And then a nice quick way to get to them is if you have a look on Ableton, you see you've got this add folder icon. So you can add a folder and I'll just do my downloads. Oops. So I go to downloads, hit OK. And now when I click on downloads, you can see that inside here is all those folders that I've downloaded. So I've got uh, Ambient, I've got Analog Drum, I've got Chill Out stuff. And you can just go in and pick stuff. So uh, Audition in. It's just a case of dragging it in. So I'll do that. And then, um, <laughs> excuse me. And you can just quickly build up a nice uh, rhythm. So let's just go for these. And you can quickly get a track going. All right, in the next video, I'll show you some techniques for uh, looping these things, layering them up, and getting a bit more of an arrangement going.